Hey peeps, it's JJ with Baby Girl Crafting. It's Cotton Cuts time. I didn't cover on my address, so. Cotton Cuts time. It's a mystery box. It's not a mystery box, it's a mystery quilt, mystery block of the month quilt. And I'll put the information about it down in the description box. And I have to apologize because I didn't do last month's yet. And it's not like it's that hard, I just haven't done it. Setting up the cameras and stuff. And with taking my son to school and everything I've had going on in my house, I'm so sorry. So forgive me, and I will rectify my mistake soon. In fact, I was thinking about doing it tonight, but it's very, very late here while I'm recording this. So it'll probably be tomorrow, and I will do the first month and the second month. So the first month kind of gave us the instructions of how the overall general idea gave us a color code. We got to choose our own um, color scheme to do this. And then each month they pre-cut them. They pre-cut the pieces that we're gonna need, give us instructions um, to make for what we're gonna make for that month. Or, yeah. So let's see what we got in this month's. So I got, this will be a really short video. All I have is triangles. I got a bunch of triangles in this color and a bunch of triangles in this color. And I have a code, they sent us a code to tell us what number they are so we know where to put the pieces. Bunch of triangles in that piece. Can you imagine what we're going to be making? I'm thinking half square triangles. Then I have some rectangles in this color which is, I don't have my code in front of me, and a little bit bigger triangle in this one. It's all in that same color. So we got our card, which is Cotton Cuts. It says, hello, mystery quilters. We hope that you are excited about month two clues as we are. We are very happy to see all of the posts and pictures on Facebook. Please keep them coming. We also wanted to thank you again for your patience as we navigate the oops of the first month's clues. We've been working closely with our partner to understand everything that happened and to print it from, prevent it from happening again, happening going forward. As a thank you gift, we've included a pattern that can be made with fabric scraps, beautiful and functional. Happy quilting detectives, Kim and Debbie. I don't know what the problem was. Might have to look that up. Oh. Is this what it is? How cute. Okay, so we got um, a pattern to make this uh, scrap snack casserole carrier, which is kind of cool. And then this is our block of the month challenge. Bro block of the month broken dishes. I like that they give you this little card on the back so that you can uh, design your own. It says if you post your completed coloring sheet using pound CCC Oh, CC color challenge for a chance to win two yards of fabric. They're due by the 15th of each month. How cool is that? I should look into that. And then we have the instructions on how to put together the pieces that we got. So we got 16 of our number threes. Because I should have looked at this first, huh? Which was these for me. Now, if you've got this, then your fabrics might be different because if you chose a different color scheme, then we have four number fours. That's either number four or number five. I can't remember. And this one, four of these, there's, this is either number four or number five as well. And then we have two of these number threes and eight of these number threes. And we will be building squares. Well, half squares, it looks like. Oh, then we go on to this side. Oh, wow. 
Okay, so we're gonna be building a design that looks like that. So kind of like that triangle run. That's kind of cool. And I do need to figure out the scant quarter inch, which actually I know how to make, I figure that out now. And I was gonna do a video on it. And that has been what's been keeping me held up with getting this done. Um, so that's what I'll be working on. So check back soon and I will have these blocks put together so I'm caught up so that next month when I get them, I'll be ready to just sit down and do them. I'm so excited. I really want to do this. I like projects and I just, I have done a lot of crocheting recently. I just finished an afghan and I'll be posting a video about that as well. And we'll be working on a new stitch. I have two new stitches that we're going to start working on over the next few weeks and some projects to go with each of those stitches. I'm just finishing up my part of doing the crochet so I can do the video for you. All right, later peeps.